Ever wondered what happens to your body when you stop exercising? Well, you're about to find out. We're going on a journey, exploring the effects of halting your workout routine. We'll be looking into how your heart efficiency changes, the impact on your muscle strength, and even how your motivation can take a hit. This isn't just about fitness, it's about understanding your body better. So buckle up and let's dive into the science behind the effects of not exercising. Before we go any further, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. The heart, a vital organ, doesn't take kindly to inactivity. It's a fact backed by science, and the effects can be more serious than you might think. When we exercise regularly, our hearts become more efficient at pumping blood throughout our bodies. It's a little like upgrading from a bicycle to a high-performance sports car. But what happens when we hit the brakes and stop exercising? Well, the heart's efficiency starts to decrease. That high-performance sports car begins to feel more like an old clunker. It struggles to keep up with the demands of your body. You see, the heart is a muscle, and like any muscle, it needs to be worked out regularly to stay strong and healthy. Without regular exercise, the heart becomes less effective at pumping blood, which can lead to a decrease in overall health and well-being. You may start to feel more tired, less energetic, and you might even find that tasks that were once easy become more challenging. You see, a less efficient heart means less oxygen. And nutrients are getting to your muscles and organs, which can impact everything from your energy levels to your ability to concentrate. But here's the kicker. It's not just about feeling sluggish or tired. A decrease in heart efficiency can also increase the risk of cardiovascular disease, one of the leading causes of death worldwide. It's a sobering thought, isn't it? So, if you're thinking of skipping your next workout, remember your heart won't be too happy about it. Your muscles, too, have a thing or two to say about not exercising. Now let's delve into what happens when your muscles are denied their regular workout routine. Scientific findings reveal that skipping the gym for several consecutive days can lead to a decrease in muscle strength. Imagine your muscles as a team of diligent workers. With regular exercise, they're busy, efficient, and their productivity, that is, your strength is at its peak. But when you stop exercising, it's like giving them an unplanned vacation. The longer the vacation, the more they start to slack off and your strength begins to dwindle. This decreased strength isn't just noticeable when you try to lift heavy weights at the gym. It also affects your daily activities. Simple tasks like carrying groceries or climbing stairs might start to feel more challenging. Your overall physical performance takes a hit and you might find yourself feeling sluggish and fatigued more often. The average person maintains a fairly constant level of strength for about four weeks of inactivity, but the longer the workouts are skipped, the harder it becomes to regain that lost strength. It's like trying to kickstart a stalled engine. It requires more effort and time, but don't worry, it's not all doom and gloom. Getting back into your routine and gradually increasing your workout intensity can help regain lost muscle strength. And remember, it's easier to maintain muscle strength with consistent exercise than it is to build it from scratch. So, keep in mind, a day off from exercise could mean a step back in your strength goals. Now let's talk about an often overlooked aspect. Motivation. The longer we go without exercising, the more difficult it becomes to reignite that spark, to get back into the groove. It's almost as if our body becomes complacent, comfortable in its state of rest. And the idea of breaking that comfort zone becomes daunting. But here's the thing, this, this mental hurdle is just as important to overcome as the physical ones. Regular exercise is not just about maintaining heart efficiency or muscle strength. It's about mental health as well. The endorphins released during a workout can help combat stress, improve mood, and even boost self-confidence. When we stop exercising, we rob ourselves of these benefits. Moreover, exercise can be a source of structure and routine in our lives, providing a sense of control and purpose. Without it, we may feel a bit lost, a bit out of sync. To overcome this, it's suggested to start by doing about 70% of what you were doing before your break in terms of time and intensity. It shouldn't take longer than two weeks to adapt again, Remember, staying active isn't just about physical health, it's also about mental well-being. So there you have it. That's what happens to your body when you stop exercising. 
We've unpacked how your heart efficiency decreases and muscle strength diminishes. We've also touched on the challenge of regaining motivation. It's clear then that regular exercise is key to maintaining good health. But don't worry, if you've had a break, it's never too late to start again. By doing about 70% of your previous workout routine, you can reclaim your fitness in no time. And before you go, thank you so much for watching our video and please make sure to subscribe to our channel. If you want to give up alcohol, watch the video on your screen next. If you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a comment below and remember your body appreciates every workout so keep moving.